Got a question coming in from Willie. Willie, appreciate you being here. Um, Leonard Taylor, does he take a step back and be allowed to fully develop with uh, all the transfer up front? Is that the great Willie Williams? <laughs> I, I don't know. Willie Williams of the Pittsburgh Steelers, meaning? <laughs> I don't know. But, uh, asking about Leonard Taylor. So with Leonard Taylor, um, I think he's a guy where I think the staff ha has kind of pushed him to limits where I don't know if he's necessarily been to yet. I think he's going through a lot of growing pains, and that's a good thing and a bad thing, obviously. But I think right now he's he's showing to himself, and he's also showing to the staff that he can he can reach limits that he's never even expected to. Um, I think this is a guy where, you know, obviously – him at the high school level, he was just bigger and better and more dominant than everyone else, similar to Nesta Severa. But once they hit the college program, you know, you're kind of on the same playing field, if not, you know, a step behind in some cases when you're lining up against certain teams. And I think Leonard Taylor, I think, you know, once he gets in the groove of things, he's going to be one of the most dominant players in the nation, in my opinion. I think what, what helps with this program is you have multiple guys that are going to be able to switch and line up in different positions. I believe Leonard Taylor has has lined up on defensive end in, in certain cases as well for the Miami Hurricanes this offseason already. Um, so depending on the scheme and the way, you know, we're rushing certain teams and the attack that we're going after, you're going to see Leonard Taylor move in different directions on this uh, defensive line front, and it's just going to create havoc for your offensive line. And I think it's a, it's a good thing for a guy like Leonard Taylor where you don't have to niche – you don't have to essentially lean on someone like him to be that dominant guy you let him kind of, you know, ease his way into things and him being only a sophomore right now, I think that's a, a very good sign and I expect very big things for Leonard Taylor. 